I was probably more nervous going back to court for my hearing than I was the first time around. The first time, I didn't know anything, so I was anxious about being in the right court and saying the right thing. But going back for the hearing, there was a lot more talking I'd have to do. The hearing is a trial, like you see on TV, but it's not so dramatic. But it is still you versus the prosecution. The main thing to remember is that the prosecution has to prove their case. You don't have to prove that you're innocent. Having said that, it is a good idea for you to have some evidence to support your case and witnesses. You prove your case by having your witness tell the magistrate what they saw. Be organised and stick to the facts. The matter of Anna Duncan. Anna Duncan? Miss Duncan, could you come forward and sit at the table, please? When I heard my name, I thought, here we go. And I took a deep breath. Right then, are we ready to proceed? Uh, yes, Your Honour. Sergeant? Yes, Your Honour. OK, Sergeant, please call your first witness. Thank you, Your Honour. I call Senior Constable Walsh. The prosecutor always goes first. That usually means having the police officer that booked you tell their version of events. Do you swear by Almighty God that the evidence you shall give will be the truth, the whole truth and nothing but the truth? I do. That's done in a series of short questions and answers. That is correct. And what did you do then? I signalled Miss Duncan to move to the left hand side of the road and stop. I parked my vehicle and spoke with her. Then I gave her a fine for using a handheld mobile phone whilst driving. Thank you, Senior Constable. No further questions, Your Honour. 